I'm going to be filming an all day event soon coming up. And I don't think the production has a chair for me. And I don't want to be standing up all day for this video shoot. So I bought this collapsible stool on Amazon. I'm going to unbox it and give my first impressions. And then uh, I'll, uh, I won't do a follow up of this. I'm assuming this is going to be a fine seat for me. But if this ends up being a problem, then I'll do a follow up review of it. From what I've seen online, and the reviews I've read on Amazon. This is highly rated and should work fine for my needs. I've seen other models where there's a cushion that you could put on. There's no cushion here, it's just hard plastic. All right, there's a strap here, that's nice. Oh, another strap, oh, I see. So it you can just fit it around this thing or just have it there. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put this in my production kit and it's, I like how how thin this is. This is like what, uh, eight inch diameter or something like that, maybe less. And it's, it's very lightweight. And how you open it, I think you grab it like that and you twist. Oh, there we go. Yeah, like an accordion. Great. Yeah, the physics of this makes sense. It's, it's padded, sort of. Uh, is that padding? Oh no, it's not rubber. It's just extra plastic on the bottom here. And the design has these locking mechanisms. And if you just had one or two of them, you know, it wouldn't be enough to support your weight. But I think this supports up to 300 pounds. But when you have a series of them, it locks in pretty tight. You're not gonna fall on your butt. And then you could, let me just twist it again. I'm trying to, oh, there we go. So you can set it at different lengths. It's kind of tricky. I might have to get used to it, but yeah. This will be my stool for this all day production. I'm assuming you can also stand on it too, but this diameter isn't, it, it only fits one foot and I wouldn't trust standing on it. This is probably be good just for a seat. If anyone was curious, here's a size of a full Apple box. And then this is the chair fully extended. So a lot of people flip this up like this and take a seat on this, which is perfectly fine, which is what Apple boxes are meant for, stuff like that. But in this case here, you can see the size difference. So when you do extend it, it's not as long as when you flip an Apple box over to sit on it. I thought that was just an interesting note for people who would want to use this for production.